Hello guys, I'm back here for another video, and I'm here to show you my Marvel Cinematic Universe collection. I was going to do all the Marvel uh, Blu-rays in this, but I'm just for the sake of time, I'm just going to do the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So, uh, we got the main three phases right there, and then we got some extra stuff over here that I'll show. So let's start off with phase one, of course. We got uh, Iron Man. In the last video that you guys seen, if you watched it, it was just the basic Blu-ray that I had, but I know I have the two disc with the slip cover. The Incredible Hulk, 4K, one of my favorite MCU movies. Iron Man 2. Again, another one that I got a slip cover for. Thor, limited 3D edition. Captain, Rivers, uh, Captain America, the first Avenger. I really like this one. Uh, slip cover. And then Avengers basic blu-ray and then uh, chase 2 we have Iron Man 3 another one that uh, well, that's got a cool cover too with the rainbow effect um, this is another one that I got a new the uh, I had the basic blu-ray and DVD before now I got the uh, 3d version and for the Dark World, I actually got the 3D itself at the swap shop, and then I actually paid, uh, I got the, um, the slipcover on eBay. And then uh, Captain America, the Winter Soldier. Guardians of the Galaxy. Age of Ultron. Really cool a slip on that one as well. And then unfortunately this one still doesn't have a slip cover. It's really hard to find it. Um but we got Ant-Man. I don't unfortunately have Ant-Man in the Wasp. I haven't gotten it yet. Uh, I just actually watched it on Netflix. So that was pretty cool. I did like it. I just haven't gotten a chance to buy it yet. And we got Civil War. Doctor Strange, the basic Blu-ray, not the 3D. And then Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. If you've seen my other video, then you will know I have a couple of different versions of these movies. I gave the uh, other ones to my mother, along with the 3D of Avengers. But I did have the I do have the Walmart exclusive slipcover for this. It's actually in my closet. And then uh, Spider-Man Homecoming on 4K. Thor Ragnarok. Black Panther, Avengers Infinity War, I did not have this one before, but this isn't the first version of Avengers Infinity War I bought, this is just the uh, 4K slipcover release. The first version I bought, well, I bought it on the day of release, and this is the Steelbook. But let's go ahead and uh, get into, like I said, one of my favorite MCU movies, we got a couple of different versions of The Incredible Hulk, along with the 4K one. This is the original release with the slipcover. Most commonly, it, it's uh, it's got this sleeve, but it's just the blue case. But this is the green case. Really like this lenticular, and it's not the lenticular itself is not really scratched all that much. There's a little bit of gunk on here from a sticker that was there, but the the slip itself is not in great condition. But I I can't. Um, I can't get rid of it. I like it too much. And then here, I got the in matching uh, Hulk, 2003 Hulk with it. But it's this comic book style. I really like this. I was hoping that it, it's it's actually based off the Steelbook. There's a Steelbook like it. I don't have that. But this is what I was talking about. That's what the normal Blu-ray looks like. I haven't opened it because I have no reason to. But I really, really like this slip cover on it. And then we have the re-release of the Incredible Hulk, along with the re-release 10 years Iron Man 2, Avengers, Iron Man 3, Thor the Dark World again. I had to buy this one separately. I got the sleeve from Canada, and then I had to buy the, uh, the Blu-ray by itself on eBay too. Both of them I got on eBay. And then Age of Ultron. And then, of course, the Infinity War Steelbook. 
which I really like. This is really cool. My favorite part of it is the um, is the inside. I'll show you guys that. I do have an unboxing on this on my channel, and I actually gave the uh, the 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 um, the digital code away. I knew that it, I could see it in the video. I didn't care because I, I had already bought this version. But I really like that. That's pretty cool. I'd like it more if I had Spider-Man in it. But you know, that's just that's just my personal preference. I think it's funny that there's four sections right here, and only three on this side. But then the side that has four has Hulk, and he's really big. You'd think he'd be on the other side, and the part that has four. Slots wouldn't be the small characters. But anyway, I don't know why I just... Never, never mind. Okay, so... That is my Marvel. I don't think I'm missing anything. If you guys... Here, I'll show you guys the... Uh, the slip covers. There's other ones. So here's the slip covers of the ones I gave to my mother because she didn't want the slip covers. Um, here is actually I, uh, Civil War. I this is the one I originally had, but I bought that slip cover over there on eBay because this one was dinged up. And then these ones, these ones are ones I bought from a seller, and they came in the mail all crunched. So he he actually uh, sent me new slip covers that were in better condition. But out of the ones I gave to my mother that had slip covers, it's the basic Spider-Man Homecoming and then the 3D. So you can see I do have the 3D. I just don't have the, it with me. It's at my mom's house. And then the Walmart exclusive slip. And then Iron Man 3. So yeah, that's that. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.